Sonic fans, we're here again, once again, with Joe Neat. Hey, Neat seeing you again. It's good to see you Doing again. great. Good to see you again. How's E3 treating you today? It's good. It's good. It's been a it's been a hectic day, a busy day, but uh, it's been great to like uh, have the hands on for the guys again. And this is the first time that like members of the public, I guess, um, can see the game, right? Um, uh, instead of just you guys, journalists, because obviously in the uh, the San Francisco event, there was only like 30 people there or something, right? So now we've got so many more people playing the game and we're getting really positive feedback from everyone. So it's just really exciting and to show Golden Axe, the new track and that stuff. So yeah, it's going great. All right, now today we have the big reveal of Danica, Patrick, yes. and NASCAR getting involved in uh, Sonic and Sega All-Stars Racing. Yes. Now, how did that come to pass? Um, there were some discussions between, like, Sega America and uh, Danica Patrick's kind of people, I guess, and um, it just seemed like a really... A, a, a natural thing to do, I guess. Um, she hasn't, like, taken a Sega character slot, so it's basically an additional character on top of all the, the big roster and stuff, so um, it's, it's just... Um, a cool thing for us and like we, we don't actually have a character here today like um, in the game but um, the, the actual vehicle that we've got so because it's like a kind of cartoon version of her, of her. Um, and obviously she's a, she's a great driver um, everybody knows who she is especially in America um, and yeah it just seemed like a, a cool thing to do okay uh, now why did you guys decide to go with a sports celebrity was it more for like publicity or yeah there's obviously those kind of elements and stuff yeah absolutely but also um, the the vehicle that we've created for her really fits into the roster and really is, is a, a cool vehicle so we're kind of happy to have her there because of that so um, but yeah it's obviously you know a lot of it is a, it's a market kind of led, led thing right for, for, for stuff because it's the more publicity the better because the more sales the better that's what we want as you know and then well, then we can make more of these games you know so that's that's obviously what people are in it for they're in it to make great games and, and stuff so okay well now will there be other celebrities possibly appearing um not that I know of. Um, <laughs> though I think Danica is the only kind of um, uh, celebrity that, we're, that we like are, are working with on this. Okay, now can you give us some details on this new track you unveiled, uh, Adder's Lail? Yes, so uh, obviously this is based on the Golden Axe IP. Um, we've got a lot of nods to, to cool things, so there's the... Uh, the the kind of the big the statue of the skeleton which is obviously based on the the character select from the original Golden Axe um, it's it's all about racing on lava um, the track kind of gets destroyed as you go by there's this volcano in the background that sort of starts slowly erupting and so over each lap more and more kind of chaos and destruction happens on the track um, it's it's one of the later light, later tracks in the game so it's more challenging than the other two that we've already shown yeah I noticed that myself I had a tough time with it yeah, yeah so it's it's a tough track but it looks amazing like the visually the the, the art team like have done a tremendous job and the engine sort of just shows it off so well so um it's yeah it's su it's such a beautiful track it really is and it's um it's uh, uh yeah like i said it's, it's pretty challenging though now, has there been any six, uh, Sega characters, whether popular or, obs or obscure, that you wanted to uh, put into the game but had uh, but couldn't? Um, not really. I think we've got the ones in that we wanted. That's good to hear. Uh, is there any details you can give us about the Wii U version? Um, well, the Wii U will have some kind of um, specific game modes in integral to that kind of skew, um, to you know, to make use of the DRC and or whatever it's called nowadays. The, the you know the, the the controller with the screen in. Um, so I can't go into a specific details, but there will be kind of unique stuff on that platform because it's a you know it's a, a quite different platform from the others. So uh, it's cool that it's announced today, like, and that we can actually talk about it because we couldn't talk about it before. So um, uh, I think. That platform is very, very suited to this type of game, you know, and it'll be really interesting for us to go up, you know, on a Nintendo platform um, that's obviously the home of Mario Kart, um, and, to, and to get on there and to, you know, to see how we do and see how the see how the kind of Nintendo fans and the guys that love that that franchise, um, you know, deal with this one and take to this one. It'll be it's going to be really interesting. Now, will that come out day and date with the other versions, or will that yeah. come out later? All the same. Um, can you tell us why you chose uh, Joe Masashi as a racer? Well, it's uh, <laughs> well, we've already got pirates because we've got Vice, right? And we've already got monkeys, and so it was like we needed to have ninjas. Right? It's like it's that simple. No, <laughs> and the, <laughs> that is actually what was what was talked about in discussions. But yeah, it's just it's again, it's a cool IP, right? Shin Shinobi, everybody loves Shinobi. Um, and yeah, Alex it, loves you guys for that because he's a big Shinobi fan. Exactly, and it's like it's and it's a great vehicle as well, the, like the vehicle that he drives. So it's just it's just another cool character with you know a lot of heritage, and uh, you know we we love the Sega games as much as any. So. Yeah, there's been shown a lot of Sega love in this uh, game. Um, it seems like a lot of the Sonic characters from the previous game are coming back. Or will there be any uh, ones introduced that weren't in the previous version? 
I don't think I can comment on that at this stage, unfortunately. But um, uh, okay. Uh, now, what's the date you're sitting for right now? Basically, it's like holiday season uh, this year, so um, the, the specific date for, for announce of release hasn't been announced yet, but basically holiday season, so, you know, later this year, around the time that all the other games come out as well, you know, just uh, before Thanksgiving, that kind of time. So. Okay, well, thank you so much. Cheers. Appreciate everything. See you guys again.